welcome back to Daily Language Review, week five, day one. Write the sentences correctly. One way to be smartier is to get a good night's sleep. <laughs> smartier. I'm not going to feel smartier if I have to say that again. It's not supposed to have an eye on it. You're right. So take your eye out of smarter. Smartier to make it smarter. One way to be smarter is to get a good night's sleep. It does need a period at the end. Nicely done. The what, what? No, B is fine. Nights. What's wrong with nights? It has, it has an S at the end. It's supposed to have an S at the end. What? You need an apostrophe in nights. Cause good nights. Between the T and the S, you need an apostrophe. One way to be smarter is to get a good night's sleep. Okay, so my friend said, when you have slept well, you learn new information more easier. He said, sleep should be slept. S-L-E-P-T. Nicely done. What? More should be there, yes. No S on learned, you were right. When you have slept well, comma, you learn new information more easier. Close, easel, easily, nicely done. E A S I L Y. E A S I L Y. Combine the sentences to make one sentence. Go to sleep after you learn something. It will help you memorize it. No, you're close. Take out the period. What else do we need to take out? Well, it's not just the capital I. Nope, you don't need it at all. Go to sleep after you learn something will help you memorize it. Nope. Beautiful. Go should be going. G-O-I-N-G. -G. Going to sleep after you learn something will help you memorize it. Uh, sleep helps you remember things when that were you already learned. Yeah. 
that you have already learned. All right, that's all, folks. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye. That's all she